Samuel Felton was a lifelong resident of Lorraine and a 1968 graduate of Lorraine High School. Following high school, Sam served three tours in Vietnam with the United States Marine Corps from 1968 to 1971. During that service, he received the Navy Cross for extraordinary heroism in connection with combat operations in Vietnam. Specifically, he is credited with assisting three wounded Marines who were unable to return to the perimeter unassisted while he was also wounded and under enemy fire. Felton would also earn a Purple Heart for his service. Following his military service, Felton returned to Lorraine and was the owner of a karate academy and several billiard halls. However, after reflecting on the violence he observed in Vietnam, Sam focused on his true passion, helping fellow veterans. For over 45 years, Samuel Felton advocated for veterans throughout the county and state. Here is a small portion of his service. He served as the co-founder and past president of the Lorraine Veterans Council, past commander of AMVETS, commander and life member of Disabled American Veterans Lorraine Chapter 20, chairman of the Valor Home Board, member of the National Association of Black Veterans, and Ohio chairman of the Advisory Committee of Valor Home, which is a nonprofit organization that provides services for homeless veterans. Though he did not seek recognition, Sam was honored in 2006 with the Vietnam Service Multiple Medals Award, the Secretary of State's 2007 Outstanding Veterans Award, and was named Lorraine, Ohio Veteran of the Year in 2010. Felton would receive numerous proclamations and awards from local and state entities for his service. Felton was also active in the community and by encouraging academics and athletics to the youth. He was the founder of the Sam Felton Athletic Club and Youth Center and the Jackie Jones Felton Scholarship Fund for college-bound students. He was also known for giving motivational speeches at graduations, communities, and military events. In 2018, Lorraine added Sam's name to a section of each 36th Street between Grove and Clinton Avenue. It became Sergeant Samuel L. Felton Boulevard, Junior Boulevard. Recently, Central Park was renamed Samuel L. Felton Jr. Central Park. Sadly, Sam Felton passed on May 23, 2020. He is survived by his wife, Sonia R. Felton, and his two sons, Colin T. Lewis and Samuel Felton III. Please welcome Samuel Felton to the Lorraine Alumni Association Hall of Fame. Good morning. Good morning. Um, my name is Daniel Rucker. Uh, Sam Felton was my uncle. Um, won't be, I'm gonna be very brief. Uh, got a lot of stories. Um, me, uh, I wasn't even understanding what today was. When my mother asked me, uh, my cousins, Colin, uh, who's in West Virginia right now, um, couldn't be here. And my other cousin, uh, Lil Sam, couldn't be here. So when she asked me, I had to schedule, you know, flights to be here. So um, I'm honored. And I'm sure he's honored looking down at all of you. Um, got plenty of stories about him. And a lot of you know the work that he's done. And I can honestly tell you, none of this he did for recognition. Um, he honestly did everything just because it was his passion, you know. So um, it's funny because uh, uh, my business was in Lorraine for so for a while. When I came, I, have, I left when I graduated Admiral King in '99, and um, I came back to give opportunities to, you know, people who had a dream, and um, to be here in the city. It reminds me of what growing up was like. And um, growing up with him was 
tough, but loving. Like, he, he had a story. He'll tell the same story every holiday. <laughs> and, <laughs> and it would be as it, it's funny as it was the first time you heard it, you know. So, um, he's missed very deeply. Um, I just had a dream about him a couple of days ago. Uh, and and I've just seen him shaking his head and saying, you miss me, don't you? You know, he's 100% correct. Uh, you know, growing up, uh, we're a tight-knit family. We're small. You know, my grandmother, uh, Mrs. Mary Jo Rucker, only had five children. And out of those five children, it was nine of us. So um, plenty of times it was, you know, me, my Uncle Sam, and my grandmother, you know, growing up in the house. and. Yeah, I didn't have it good either way. So, um, again, it's, it's an honor. I didn't even know I was going to speak, so all this is just, I'm just talking. Uh, <laughs> I thought I was going to come eat a good food. and. <laughs> um, but again, thank you all for this. I'm sure he's honored to be with every one of you. Um, and I see some familiar faces. Like I see, I used to play basketball with, with him. I remember him. Uh, and I think the speaker, am I correct? Is you Mr. Fer Mr. Ferguson? Yes, I am. <laughs> see, he was one of our basketball coaches. You know, so it's uh, great to see all of you. And again, God bless. Thank you.